YouTube Chicks <laughs> Get ready You know what to do Chicks so listen, Chicks Smooth Hey Chicks Smooth Appreciate all the coverage that you been doing I've been watching your shit for a while I just subscribed to your shit too bro Aw oh, man Drake is not gonna like this Joe At this point we gotta set up the 1v1 between Drake and Joe There's too much tension between these two guys Too much animosity anytime one person is brought up Coming off of Drake's beef with Kendrick Lamar Where Joe was not exactly fair to Drake in some of his critiques about him Joe can continued a little bit of the hate as he trashed Drake's new song with Camila Cabello. So if you're a Drake fan at this point, you're not exactly too fond of Joe. Seems like he's always bashing your favorite artist no matter what he does. Well a couple days ago on Twitter Spaces, Joe held a very very interesting Twitter space where he brought up a Drake fan. Joe titled it a space for negativity so he already knew the smoke was coming. As soon as the Drake fan came up on stage, boy did he let Joe have it. And in turn, Joe was not backing down. He went on to throw some shots at Drake while dissing his fan. Here's a conversation. Why are you such a f hater? Stop hating. But, but why are you care if I hate coattail? Now I hate both of y'all. Oh well, stop hating the fucking goat. You were following him around Toronto streets like a puppy. Got the video. Get off his dick. He's the fucking greatest rapper of all time. Greatest artist of all time. And you all right, buddy. I have followed two people in my life. That is Prince. And Memphis Bleak, I know, it's wild, don't ask. There's no video of me doing anything in Toronto or following anybody in Toronto. Now you're just lying in your negativity. I'll allow it, but come on, buddy. Get creative with your negativity. There's no videos. I hate you. How about that? I'm keeping it on you now. I hate how you are sucking this Canadian man's dick. I hate that I feel like he put that beat off video out for like you and Funny Best. I hate that all that sound like you that come up here with this type of rhetoric and jargon sound like y'all don't get no pussy and no bitches. I hate the fact that you got time to talk to me about this and all of this pussy is around and you want to put this energy toward me. I hate that about you non-pussy. How about that? It's still hate. All that shit that you just said, that sounds like a bunch of high school shit. You just basically got on a space like Kendrick got on a track. You hate it. Stop hating on Drake. You hate the way you walk, talk, and, and touch dog. Why are you looking at how I walk? We we hate the we we hate everything about Joe Button. We hate everything about the no, quitter Joe Button. No, you don't. You love me. Everything about you the quitter love me. Joe Button. If you love the nigga him, you love me by default. That's hate, my son hate and you my everything about Mr. Pump it up. Pump, you pump are it my up. Pump it, uh, with that we hate everything about on. Mr. Pump It Up. That 2000 you ass love song, pump it up. baggy and ass. And you look clothes, like you dude. might have been conceived fucking to pump it up. It up. What the fuck ass. are you talking about? That shit is a two pack of ass. You love that it. Shit you ass. bought it. That shit you ass. bought it. You, that shit sound you, you, you like, made up like a logic track. That shit sound like a logic track. You watched Stop the Yard and got hot with so much, but that Pump It Up track sounds just like logic. That shit sound like some Walmart 2000 shit microwaved ass rap. Get back in the fucking booth, pal, because that shit ain't it. Turn that shit off. That shit whack. That's why you quit. You're a fucking quitter. Oh, Turn no, that quitting like shit now. off. No, no. I don't like it now. I told you I need you to be more creative with your hate. Don't start just repeating hate that you heard. I'm going to unmute you, but be original in your negativity. We have a good thing going here. Uh, there you go. All right. You back? Get here, buddy. We hate you. All right, well, I hate you too. If you love Drake, then you love me by default. That's my son and you my grandson. God damn, Drake is not going to like that, Joe. And on top of that, Joe, you might want to stay away from Toronto for about a good year or two. We don't want to see you end up like Rick Ross out there. Now, Joe has been on record stating that anytime Drake drops a record, he makes about a million dollars. People want to hear him break down Drake lyrics and people also want to hear what he has to say about Drake in general. Have you guys ever been fired from a job and on top of that you had to deal with an injury? That's exactly how my first job out of college went. I was working at a major hospital in my city, strained my back while lifting a patient. Boy did that suck you guys. Briefly I thought about getting a lawyer but I thought it was going to be way too expensive. And coming right out of college, bro I was broke. Fast forward to now, boy was I foolish. I could have been rich, you guys. I had no clue about companies like Morgan & Morgan that are completely free. 
Yes, free, unless you win. No, seriously, you guys, there's no upfront cost. There's no sign up fees. If you don't win your case, you pay them nothing, zero dollars. These guys are the largest injury law firm in America. If any of you guys out there ever got seriously injured, your case could be worth millions. Guys, I'm telling you, please don't be like me. They make it super easy for you guys now. You can start your claim right now with Morgan & Morgan at ForThePeople.com backslash chicks or by scanning the QR code right here. Now, excuse me, you guys. I got to go yell at my parents for not knowing this and me not being rich right now. I'll be back. So if all I gotta do to make millions is just speak on Drake or mention his name, I'm probably gonna lean into the hate a little bit more. Knowing how Joe operates, he probably sent that shot so Drake can possibly respond back to him. Which is a pretty genius move if you ask me. Drake fans are never going to like me, so I might as well piss him off in the process. But I will say this, Joe, as a multi-millionaire, you should never ever be on Twitter spaces arguing with a stand in a meaningless conversation. You guys get in the comments below what do you guys make of joe calling drake his son push comments below subscribe to my channel like this video i'll see you guys later man